Let's get this straight. Your chair may be killing you. Constantly sitting and doing no form of exercise is the new lifestyle for most people, especially those who do an eight to five job and sit at a computer all day. But I bring you good news. This is actually the very best time to start exercise. In this video, I'm going to tell you the amazing benefits of starting exercise and why you need to start exercising now. My name is Dr. Becky and I make food and wellness videos. The number one reason why you have to start exercising now is because research has shown that in our older years, we need the benefits of exercise to help us maintain our mobility, our muscles and our bones. What do I mean by our older years? The research is saying that from the mid years, that is 40 to about 60, the amount of exercise that you do is super important in making sure that you have an amazing retirement. So what are you waiting for? This is actually the time if you fall in that age range. The other reason is exercising now helps you to build muscles. The muscle is an amazing organ in the body. If you don't use it, you're going to lose it. So the more you exercise, the more you do resistance training, you're going to build your muscle by providing it with that resistance to grow. You know the interesting thing? When I was in school, one thing we learned about muscles is if you even trying to grow muscles, you know, in a culture form, you have to put it in Velcro, a way to provide resistance for the muscle to grow. Isn't that amazing? So exercising, doing resistant training will keep your muscles alive and you don't want to lose your muscles. Another reason which really applies to women is that, you know, exercising would help your older years because during menopause usually around 51 and upwards where menopause occurs in women the hormonal changes causes weight gain so you don't want to gain a lot of weight in your older years because that is even going to put more pressure on your bones that's why you have people falling and breaking their bones because at that time you're more vulnerable you have a lot of osteoporosis going on there but if you have the weight on you then it's even going to make it more difficult for your bones. So you want to protect your older years, menopausal times, which could even make you gain more weight. You want to protect yourself from that by introducing exercise now. The other reason why you have to exercise now is, you know, it builds a habit. Just try it every day, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 15 minutes, one hour a day can help you build that habit and it becomes your lifestyle and exercising should not be difficult just taking a walk riding a bicycle just squatting all are different forms of exercise that can be helpful to your body and you want to build that habit habits are not easy to build in a day you have to do it for at least 21 days to really get into it so start today for 21 days and you see that it becomes a part of you Another reason is that exercise helps to improve your mood. How does it do it? You know, when you exercise, your body is able to release the feel good hormones like dopamine, serotonin, and those would help you to have a very happy mood. And it also changes the way your brain perceives reward. You know how sugar is able to trigger that reward part of your brain. And when you eat sugar, you're very excited. When you exercise and your body gets used to the dopamine, serotonin being released into your blood and it's circulating, those can make you very excited and your body now begins to perceive exercise as a reward form or something that you should be excited about. And by doing so, the body is also able to sleep better. So exercise helps to improve your sleep. If you're someone who is having problem with sleep, you should try exercising, walking 30 minutes a day and see if your sleep is not improved. Another very exciting benefit of exercise is it helps with your digestion. It helps to clean your gut. It helps to give you a very good bowel movement. You're not going to experience a lot of constipation when you exercise. So that is a good way to give your other brain, which is your gut, a good time. My last reason is the longer you wait to exercise, 
the more harder it becomes the more the negative effects would show on your body if you wait too long and you gain so much weight and you now go into exercise mode or a dietary plan to reduce the weight you're going to have loose skin all over and you would need surgery which is another added stress so you don't want that so i want you to start exercising today i've made a video on the kind of proteins that you should eat if you want to build muscles and also the amazing benefits of avocado and i think that they are related to this video so people like subscribe watch those videos and tell me what you think and i will see you on the next video bye bye